Hi, I'm Kenneth from uh, Facebook page Thai Kabura. Today I'll be doing a review of the um, Tilwalk Thai game uh, reels, which are the DG270, the latest one, uh, and the DG70. Um, okay, uh, let me adjust the video, the camera a bit closer. All right, there you go. Now here I have both the um, DG70, all right? It has the um, depth counter, okay? And this one is the um, aluminum body frame, okay? And carbon cover, all right? The ratio is um, 7.0 to 1, so it's a pretty high speed kind of reel, okay? And the uh, drag is about 5.5 uh, kg. Okay, now per rotation, you're probably pulling in approximately about 81 or maybe slightly more, all depends on the PE line you put. Okay, all I have here is all the PE2. Uh, PE2, this is a tough line here. And this one comes uh, originally, it comes with the um, 100 mm uh, highly uh, strengthened and light uh, weighted duralium metal crank handle okay and EVA arms okay with a similar reel I have here um, what I did was I just add on the carbon handle okay so um, not much of a difference it's, it's the same it's just like a little bit cutting out the weight of this um, um, reel okay and uh, again this is uh, five uh, bearing plus one so it's six bearing kind of a uh, reel uh, then this one is about two without any um, blinds in you're looking at approximately about 260 gram okay and now the latest one you can see um, the tail walk um, Elan uh, DG270 um, comparing to the normal 70 you see it's matted okay on this side all matted matted as well this is glossy finish yeah and same ag again it's aluminium um, body as well carbon cover and um, what What's best is it comes with this carbon handle, right? I've tried it with this carbon handle um, last 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 trip out, and I can tell it's really smooth, um, and it's very easy to use. Okay, now the advantage to this is basically I think this one will be approximately about two hundred and fifty-five gram. Uh, both drags are the same, 5.5 kg, okay, except that uh, with a matte look um, and carbon handle, knob, everything, it's basically value for money, kind of real. And um, I like it. Uh, it performs pretty well. Uh, caught some um, local snappers with it. Um, Again, uh, I have a line system PE2 in here and uh, Seaguire FXR number 8, which is about 30 pounds. Okay, very simple to use, uh, very simple to maintain as well. And with this DG2, I find it uh, comparing to the, the older version, uh, not much of a difference except for body, but with a matte finish, it's pretty sleek. Yeah, okay. So you can see the difference. Let me show you the difference here. Okay. Yeah. Right. Okay. And then on the side. Bottom. Same. Yeah. Except that um, this is black and silver. Whereas this is... Uh, reddish copper kind of color uh, star drag this one is in black 
Okay. Well, I I don't know how much it'll cost from where you are, but um, you do check out um, Tailwalk uh, website. Um, Tailwalk uh, website should have more info and uh, whether there's a, a dealer in your country or not. But uh, I can tell you, this is a very good tie-in um, reel. And it's very, very um, affordable. I wouldn't say, um, I wouldn't say that it's expensive. Uh, there are a couple of brands that I know, uh, comparing to Shimano, Grappler, um, with a counter. Um, uh, in Malaysia, this is approximately about 800. Uh, the Grappler was about 1,300. So it's about 500 ringgit difference. In terms of US dollars, uh, in terms of sterling pounds, is about 100 pounds difference. Um, comparing to the Shimano um, to walk again um, it's reasonable value for money um, very uh, user-friendly easy to maintain and uh, let's say again good gear all right so uh, do stay tuned um, share or like our videos and um, our page and uh, I do look forward to showing you more reviews in terms of uh, Thai uh, Kabura jigs as well besides uh, tailwalk equipments all right so have a good day uh, have a good day and um, see you soon cheers